Hello, welcome to this Code Composer Studio quick tip video. This video will demonstrate importing projects and there is in fact a video demonstrating project export too, which may be of interest. So importing projects, we go to project, import existing CCS Eclipse project to start the import wizard. This default select search directory is if you're browsing to a workspace folder that has a project in it, or basically a project folder. So let's click browse. I happen to know that this is a workspace folder here that I've created earlier with two projects. And if I select OK, I see Code Composer Studio finds both those projects. You can import one or both. Let's just import project two for now. You have the option to copy the project into the workspace, which will literally copy those project files as a new project completely under this workspace. And you can also import any reference projects. Since I know that this project doesn't reference any other projects and it's not important to have it copied into this other workspace, but left where it is, that's fine. I'll click finish. And we see that project two is now in our workspace. Now, if we had been given or if we'd previously exported a project to an archive file, we need the same import wizard to import that as well. So imp project import existing CCS Eclipse project, select archive file this time. So we need to change the radio button, select browse. I happen to know that right in C, I have a couple projects that I've exported to an archive file, including CCS export two, and I select open. And it found the archive project demo. And so let's click finish once again to bring the project demo into the workspace. And one final thing is what happens if it was a Code Composer Studio version four project. So there's a few things that we'll have to watch for here. It's the same import wizard project, import existing CCS Eclipse project. Let's go back because we're gonna browse to a CCS version four workspace that I created earlier. And let's browse. It happens to be here under my documents, and it happens to be this workspace folder here with the project first. Select OK. And once again, the project first is found with these options. And let's select Finish and bring that project in. Now, one thing to note, especially when importing from a somewhat older version, is that some settings or some things may need you may need to be aware of. So for example, if I select first here, I can see, oh, there's a warning. What is the warning? Well, it's telling me that the project was actually created with an old compiler version, not installed in this version of Code Composer Studio. So it's certainly something to be aware of. Compiler version change can, can have an impact on your code, of course. So let's right click and go into the properties to see a bit more details. And here we see that, yes, indeed, it was created with 3.3.3. 3 .3. However, CCS is, go is saying it's planning to use 4.2.3, actually, to do, to do the compiling and linking. So if that is OK in your case, then you can very safely ignore that warning. Otherwise, be aware of this in order to either bring in a different compiler version install it into this copy of CCS as required, or make any necessary changes. You may also find at times importing old projects that your include paths options and variables may also need to be double checked. Thank you very much for your time.